two in a row from the forehand corner, twiddles the racket to play a backhand attack from the forehand corner. Watch this, first forehand, heavy spin. He's already twiddled, has to come way outside for that to play it to the deep backhand. To even move like that seems like it should hurt the body. To play it to the short side of the table on top of that, who could possibly be prepared for that ball? Winner here will be playing Lingrid Ru. If it is Ru and Philus, there's a rich history there. Good placement on the serve, Calderano leaving it uncomfortably to the forehand. Shallow on the table. So low for a shot. Felus perfectly calibrated for the top spin coming in. Wow. You can see the soles of the shoe there. I guess one sole per shoe. But either way, you see the bottom of Ugo Calderano's feet as he had to turn to get low for that. If only Ruben Felu stays at the table. This is all because Hugo Colorado plays this drop shot. Looks like he's going to attack. Soft touch, shallow. Felu's casually wishing, ah, if only. Well, now, watch out, assistant umpire. Felu's turning an attack from that deep backhand corner. It's all or nothing on this shot. A lot of footwork and still has to lean way back. It sets him up by two. Filus two points away from a massive win against the world rank number five. The top eight on the men's side are dropping like flies. The tired type, that is. Eight, sort of a weird saying, really. I don't know if flies, most of the time they're flying. See one right now. Eight serving nine, Ugo Calderano. One point away from tying it up. The last two serve combination of this game will be with Ruin Felix. So clever from the middle, he turns and plays to the forehand line. It is two match points for Ruin Felix against the world number five, Ugo Calderano. Loaded with spin, but about chest height, Felus is able to make good and convert that point. Ruin Felus with a massive comeback against Andre Gacina in the first round. Backhand carries long, Colorado saves match point. One more to go for the dangerous Felus. He shakes it off, says, okay, let's do it here and now. But Colorado saves two match points. That fast, long pitch shot. It is so tricky. You can see the smiles in the crowd. That ball right there should cause trouble for most players. Colorado with the perfect read of a very empty attack. Lick, lick in action out here. Alternating serves now. Deuce. Backhand down the line and for the third time this match. It is match point for Willie Fimus, the world rank number 33. Danger, danger. He's a dangerous man with a racket in his hand. Get to the chopper! Ruin Felus and taking down the world number five. What a performance from the 35-year-old German top chopper, Ruin Felus. When defenders attack, you've got to watch your back. The German moves on through to the round of eight, the quarterfinals here at the WTT. Champion seems 
Young, what a performance. Every single game after being dominated in game number one came down to a nail-biting finish. Only two points to separate them in games two, three, and four. What a score, and once more, the man here, Ruin Filus, bringing choppers back like Justin Timberlake and Sexy. Look at that spin. Had him turning, and it pays off the attacking game of the chopping man. Ruin Filus will have a chance to hear from after this incredible victory. Another one bites the dust, courtesy of this man, Ruin Filus, down to you. Congratulations, Ruben. So you must be thrilled with a victory over world number five, Hugo Colorado. How did you overcome your opponent? Uh, I'm really, really happy to win this game. I could manage to attack really much points. I win my point myself, make less mistakes in defense, so this was the key, I think. Now, into the quarterfinal, you're up against the Levy Ru who just showed us what he's capable of by beating the GOAT Malone. How are you going to prepare for this clash tomorrow? Yeah, now I want to rest a little bit because my body is a little bit tired. But that matter, I thought tomorrow I'll give my best again against Lin. Last time I won, it was a really close match, so I want to give my best. And yeah, hopefully, same close and in Kazakhstan. Thank you, congratulations again. Congratulations. So looking for the same finish as he had in a nail-biting comeback from down 0-3 against Lin Win Ru in Kazakhstan, looking for that victory. So he's going to rest and enjoy. It's an important thing. You can work out hard, but that rest, your body needs to repair. Remember that. So the table has been set. The quarterfinals, Fong Zhendong and Lin Shidong up at the top of the bracket. Lin Jong-un and Alexis Lebron of France. That'll be a fascinating battle to watch. Ruben Filus. Always great to watch versus Lin Win Ru after this incredible victory over Hugo Colorado and the Jin Quinn with Wang Chu Chin. Well now, the middle four and the last, the eighth. This is only three left of the top eight seeds in a massive event. Fang Zhendong, the world number one, Wang Chu Chin, world number two, and the Jin Quinn, world number seven. Some big names and some incredible stars have been eliminated here already. So, a little reminder of what happened here today in session two. Lin Shidong, 17-year-old, three.